questions for Winston? How was the first day in pads for you physically? Just kind of get pushed, get be able to get back up. I guess how, how mm -hmm. did that feel for you? Uh, first day back, uh, going good. Just getting my confidence back, win back. It just feel good to be back in pads. What goes into getting your confidence back? Mm -hmm. like, what is that process like for you mentally, physically? Mm -hmm. Just really just getting reps, just getting back used to doing things how I was, and the confidence is growing the more reps I take, really. How do you feel now compared to maybe the full practices? Like, mm -hmm. what, what's been, where are you in kind of like the comeback since mm -hmm. say December? Oh yeah, I, I say I feel more confident in myself. Uh, I feel more in shape. Well, I'm getting back in shape as we go. But I probably feel, I feel real good where I'm at right now. Do you try to think about how I feel now versus how I felt a year ago, or is it just about where you're at right now? Uh, not, not really. Just every day, I just try to get better than I was yesterday. Just work on little things. Just work on. One day I might work on planting. One day I might work on accelerating. Just little things that the coaches tell me that I need to show in practice. Was there a moment where you? I know you, you were out here trying, man. You were mm -hmm. trying to, to get back last year. Mm -hmm. Was there a moment where you knew it wasn't going to happen for you? And, and how did you kind of process and, and figure out the road forward from there? All uh, right. So um, before the season, I sat down with the coaches and I kind of had a plan. So, like, I wasn't really in a rush. I was just trying to accomplish something, like, every week, like, whether it's in, like, just jumping, like, just doing little things. So I was just taking it one week at a time, to be honest. Where, where are you at now, like, say, when you? You get hit. Are, right. you, are you comfortable with that at this point? Right, I've been playing football since I was six, so and that's football. Used to it. How would you? We haven't gotten to see you play a ton since you got here because of the spring. You didn't get to play even like before the injury. So what? Like, would you say your strengths are right now? What do you do well as a player? Like, for mm -hmm. people who haven't gotten to see you play in person yet, mm -hmm. what do you do well? Um, I feel like I'm a fast player, so me just playing fast and just doing what I do, just reacting on the defense. You picked this place. The program was coming off not a really great season. But mm -hmm. What were you able to, to see from this program last year offensively that, that has you really, I guess, excited about what's to come now? Right. Um, just how we throw the ball and get guys the ball in different ways. Like I talked to Coach Norvell before I got here, so I was confident in the move. It was. It wasn't. I already knew. Was it better than you thought? I mean, like, you, you saw this coming the whole way. Mm -hmm. or? I don't want to put words in your mouth right now. Right. You know, did you see it come in this offense, and then how fulfilling is it to know that it's here operating at such a high level? Right, I would kind of say it's better than what I thought, um, but I'm just blessed to be here. Coach so Storms and some other people praised your, your work ethic and, and how you prepared each day. I mean, is, is that hard to be optimistic or focused on being the best you can in a comeback like this? Right, I would kind of say. Uh, you just gotta just trick your mind. And just, just you gotta just focus on one day at a time. I would just say that's the that's what I do. Just focus on one day at a time. Don't look two weeks from now. Just focus one day at a time. Did Coach Storms like set daily, weekly, monthly. Like, did he set certain goals? Right. I would say uh, the scrim staff, uh, as the um, the training staff, they have a good plan with me. Uh, week in and week out. Uh, one week we might up it. One week we might. Lower it just depending on my body, and I feel, I feel great. So I'm just thankful for that. The squat party. What what was your max here? Was it 455? Yeah, I think it was 455. Is that the highest you've ever had before? Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what's it like when you when you've seen yourself? You're hitting personal highs and just keep getting mm -hmm. stronger. Is that rewarding? I would imagine. Yeah, I mean, I was proud of myself, but I know I could go more. I'm just getting stronger. So when summer comes. I could even do more than that. Is there any final obstacle for you to clear to, to be where you want to be or are you there right now? Uh, no, I wouldn't say I, where I want to be. I'm just taking it day at a time, just getting better each each and every day until the season comes. What are your thoughts on guys like Hakeem, mm -hmm. and Darius, and those young guys mm -hmm. third day here? I mean, what, what have you seen from them? How oh, I've seen a lot of uh, with them. I think they're going to be great players here, uh, big, fast, athletic. And just they're they're gonna be good. I feel like they're gonna be good, real good players. Y'all are staying happy too. I mean, there's only one football, but then there's yeah. a lot of you guys. Are, yeah. what, what's allowing you guys to, to not be selfish and to be team first kind of guy? Well, I would say with just being a receiver, you're gonna want the ball, but you know, you just gotta. I just say you just gotta be happy for 
another person so when good things happen to you, like you'll be prepared for it. Like everybody just happy for each other. And that's what you want to be in. Yeah, All right. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks Winston. Winston. Thank you.